beautiful and blessed ones. It is Marsha Gauntlet Kirby and welcome back to Brownface TV. Uh, I didn't upload a video last week. I wasn't sure what to upload and I was still waiting for some pieces. Today it's going to be a Zara haul. I think it's going to be a part one. It's not too many pieces because I relegated myself or limited myself to like 10 pieces. I went just a little bit over, I think a couple of pieces over, but um, I usually, when I'm shopping the sale, I'm usually in and out of the stores and I'm picking up so many things. I didn't want to do that this time around. Anyway, um, I didn't have the pieces and then I had a little bit of a set. I didn't have all the pieces, I'm sorry, uh, for last week's video. And I still don't have all the pieces. I have to, there's some at the store because I went last week to pick it up and it wasn't ready yet. But I had a bit of a setback because I had what was, I thought was a corn on my toe, but it was an abscess. I went in, luckily I was able to get in right away with the doctor. He had to cut it. And anyway, I had to wear a boot. I was wearing a boot for a while. The boot is now off, thankfully, but I can't wear any clothes, closed toe shoes. It has to be open toe shoes for um, the next couple of days. So there was really no styling with these pieces so it's basically a try on anyway let's get into the video all right the first piece or i think i guess it's a two piece i bought a i love suits i've always loved suits uh, i i'm a corporate america baby I, well i grew up in corporate america so i've been wearing suits for a while i haven't i don't really wear them that much in my at my current job because you know i can wear i dress i do dress up but i can wear whatever i want but we haven't had any like I don't know. I guess I should just wear them anyway. I found this, I was looking, I think I was on Pinterest and I saw someone with a cream, a cream, uh, what do you call it? A cream blazer. And I was like, oh my God, that would be kind of cool. And then when I saw this blazer pop up, I, the pants also popped up as a, uh, you know, what to wear with it. Like, you know, when you scroll down at the bottom. So I got both pieces. So I got this, it's almost a satin look. Can you guys see this? A satin blazer. I, you know what, I probably should take the pants out. The satin blazer, it's oversized. It only came in extra small, uh, extra small, small and medium large. This was originally $89.90. Uh, it's oversized blazer. There are no, oh, I just realized there are no buttons. And I was thinking also when I picked this up that I can, um, my anniversary is coming up. So I, I was going to wear a dress, but I was like, wait a minute, I could also wear a suit. It's going to be September and right after Labor Day, it kind of cools down. So I was thinking about wearing this. I'm not sure. Anyway, it was originally 89. I got this for 20, I forgot. Was it $25, $25.99? $25.99 uh, and I got, I was able to get the pants, the pants kept going out of stock, but I was able to score a medium in the pants and they are, yep, wide leg pants, medium, yeah, and I got the pants for, these are 59, it says 39 here, I didn't get it for 39, I think I got it for, it was in the 20s, I, don't, I just don't remember what that was. If it, were, if it wasn't a suit, if it was just the pants, I would probably return the pants, but I love them together. And like I said, I can make this work for my upcoming anniversary. I'm showing you the suit first because it's the uh, base for everything else that I bought. And I'm actually surprised because a lot of stuff I bought is neutral. I think the pieces I'm waiting on, they, um, well, the pieces I have to pick up, those have some color to them, but I really surprised myself. A lot, a lot of these pieces are neutral, um, which is great because I can pair them with my color. I've never really been a trench coat girl. I did have one trench coat that I think I've since, I, I, I kept it for a while. I've, I've given it away. It was bright green, uh, Periellis bright green, and I loved it because it was bright green. But other than that, I'm not a trench, trench coat girl trench coat girl. I do have one that I got from Zara. I got it on super sale. It was $19.99. And I think I like that one because it has all these bells and whistles. But even still, I think I've only worn that twice. But uh, I think I kind of like the cropped uh, trench coat look. Uh, I think it's pretty versatile. You can wear these with high waist jeans, skirts, pants. So I picked it up. It was a little bit, it was on sale. I think it was originally six to nine. It was a little bit more that I wanted to pay on sale, but this has not come back in stock. Like I'll go on to see what has um, been reduced because I've actually was able to exchange a few things because they really, they dropped since the last time I bought them. But yeah, this has not, because I think it was a hot commodity even with it not being on sale. There's another one there for 89 and I, I definitely wouldn't because again, I'm not a trench coat girl, even though I like this look, I wouldn't pay $89 for that. And that one is still available 
if you guys are um, into the look. This one, now it's down to 25, but it ha and it's been dropping slowly. It, um, it hasn't come back in stock. And I paired these, I just paired these with everything I'm pairing with the pants from uh, the suit. Okay, I, I, I keep asking you guys who am I because again, another th I, I never really was into linen. Uh, I do or did have a couple of pieces, but I, now I see there are more and more linen, linen pieces being added to my closet. I think with linen, it's because I, I'm West Indian. Um, yeah, I think I, I think that's what it was. Like a lot of us in it back in the day, they would wear linen. I just don't know what it was. It just just turned me off. But now, OMG. Anyway, I had this in my cart since probably like last year, and as soon as it went on sale, I hit submit. Uh, this is a striped linen shirt. It's I, I guess I would say it's oversized. This is small and it fits. It's pretty roomy, but I like that. Uh, and I could even wear this into fall. So I'm not really much, not too much to say about this. Again, I tried on all the pieces with the uh, pants from the suit. And I paid, this was originally 45 and I paid 20, either, I think 25, maybe 25 or 29 for this top. I picked this up. I also had this in my cart. Uh, I could have bought this full price. It was $39.99. I got it for $19.99 though. It is a... Um, you guys know I love uh, wrap dresses, wrapped anything wrapped, and it has that wrap effect. But it also has a hood, which I think is so sexy. Oh my goodness! I did get another top to this. I really wasn't into that one too much, but it went down to like twelve ninety nine. Twelve ninety nine. I did like the the top, um, but I, I wasn't willing to pay full price for that one. So um, I did, and that's one of the pieces I'm waiting on. It went down to twelve ninety nine, so I'm waiting to pick that up. And it's in gray. You'll see that one because I do like the it's cropped and i do like the wrapped effect um i like this one because it's this one is more of a dressy material so you can wear this again skirts pants uh shorts uh very versatile top 39 like i said and i got it for 19.99 and i'm wearing it i'm pairing it with the pants in the video i also i think i showed it with the hood on which is kind of a kind of a sexy look all right this piece i've also i had also had in my cart and okay um, a disclaimer, there's a lot going on up here. So I had this in my cart. I usually wear, okay, so I had it in my cart. It was 49. I wasn't willing to pay $49 for it. Only because I saw from the pictures, it looked, it was just like a cotton dress. Like why would I pay 49, I, me personally, why would I pay for a, a cotton dress? Even though I really love the style of this. And I was even thinking because um, like I said, my 20th is coming up and we are, we, I'm speaking it right now. We are making it to our um, uh, anniversary destination on some island, okay? Anyway, so I thought of this and I was like, this would be so, uh, so cute to wear. Anyway, purchase it, $29.99. And like I said, I stalked the site. It went down to $19.99 and I did get it. So when I picked it up in a small, I usually in Zara, these cotton pieces, I get away with the small. But honey boo, I mean, it fits, but the top, there's a lot going on at the top. I would not be able to, not, I would not, but I wouldn't wear this um, in the States where people know me. I, I, this is reserved for the island. And you'll see it, I have, I'm just covering myself because it's, it's not, I'm not showing, um, it's showing a lot, let's just say that. So I was trying to, it, it's now down to $12.99, I think, and I'm trying to see if I can get it in a medium. But again, this was, this was actually, in and out of stock when it was regular price, so I don't I don't anticipate it. But I'm glad I got it for the cheaper price because um, being that there's a lot going on, at least you know I didn't pay an exorbitant amount for it. But I just really love this. I love the color and I love the bottom, which is elastic, uh, is elasticated, elastic size. I really I really like that aspect of this dress. The last piece, and woo, I actually picked this up at full price. Uh, because you guys know I love anything flamboyant. I love sequins. I love pink. I love bold color. Pick this up. It's a bomber jacket. You guys know that bomber jackets are on trend. And even though I don't really subscribe to trends, um, it was really the sequins for me. I think it was just a regular bomber jacket. I wouldn't have picked it up. So I oh, look at this. Uh, look, look at this. Anyway, I picked it up. It was oh, child. It was one hundred and forty nine dollars. Yeah, I know. It was $149 and God was on my side because when the sale started, it went down to 89 and I think I had a day, 
maybe it was a couple of days before. So I was able to return it and waited for the cheaper one to, to, to get to me. So I, I returned the one for $149. Um, maybe I was being strategic. Maybe I did. Maybe I planned that. Just buy it right before I knew the sale was going to start. And then I picked up the one for eighty nine dollars, and I was like, "All right, I'm you know I'm good to go. I know I got it for a cheaper price." Sweetheart, the the jacket went down to thirty nine dollars. I said, "Listen, we're going back to Zara. We're gonna return that. We're gonna get this one. I had it shipped to the store <laughs> because I need my pennies." Hello. So I got this beautiful sequins bomber jacket. Look at this. See the price. Look, one forty nine. One forty nine. I got it for thirty nine dollars look at this oh my gosh this is another item that kept going in and out of stock as well they, it runs pretty large um i haven't been checking on it because i already got my size so i have a small uh yeah it's i think it's i don't know actually i, I don't want to lie i think it's still 39 it may even be cheaper at this point I'm not sure if you can still find it, but I will link everything that's still available below. And I just tried this on again with the cream pants. I probably wouldn't do that um, in my normal, regular life. It'll probably be maybe some type of denim, but maybe I might have to be careful because it might rub off. But um, yeah, I ooh, uh, yeah, just some type of colored pants. Oh, with a red, with a bright pink, which I do pink or blue. Oh, even I have a yellow. Look at that, because you can see aspects of look yellow, blue, pink in the sequins right here. Look at that with the green. Look at the green in my nails. Oh my goodness me! All right, guys, that is it for I think part one of this haul. I, like I said, I do have it's not a lot. I do have a few more pieces, and I did pick up some other things, but I'm just showing you the most um, interesting pieces to me. Like I picked up, which I think those are interesting. I picked up those sheer turtlenecks, but that's more for fall, and I wasn't gonna try them because we're in the dead of summer right now. So I picked up some of those, uh, and I did pick up a blue blazer, but who wants to see a blue blazer? <laughs> actually, I, I picked that one up. It was a good price, and it actually went down. So like I said, I can need my pennies, so I'm waiting for that one at the store so I can return the, the one that I bought at higher price. But you will see, there's some linen pieces. Again, like I said, I don't know who I am, but um, there's some linen pieces that I want to show you, but that will be in part two. Um, if it's not enough to upload a whole video, I would probably upload it as a short, but, or maybe just like, a, I'll just do a really short video, but stay tuned for that. Anyway, have a blessed week and I will see you next time. Bye. I found beauty in these ashes.